Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a purple and black smoky look using the Jeffree Star Bloodlust palette. So those are the colors inside. We'll probably be using some of this purple, a little bit of this black, and then I'll probably just use Beauty Sleep, which is this color right here. On the lid, I hope everyone is staying sane and safe during this quarantine. I know that it is kind of stressful for a lot of people to be out of work or, you know, out of school, not with their families, um, if they have family somewhere else. So just do your best. Try and stay sane. Practice social distancing. And we're going to get started on this makeup look. I am going to be doing my eyebrows, which, as you can see, are a mess because I cannot leave my house to get them threaded off camera. And I'll be getting my eyes primed as well. So I will be back. Alrighty, so we have our eyebrows done, we have our eyelids primed and concealed. For concealer today, I am using the same Thank Me Later primer by Elizabeth Mott. And she actually likes my posts on Instagram when I use her products, so I think that's pretty cool. For my brows, I used my Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade in Dark Brown. And this little angle brush with a spoolie on the bottom. So I'm going to go ahead and dip into this palette, and I'm going to be starting with the Beauty Sleep on my lid, and then I'm going to be doing a little bit of Vivid Mood, which is this color right here, and Dungeon is going to be in my crease. Next, I'm going to be applying a little bit of this shade Executioner. And it's a very pretty black shade that has purple sparkles. And I'm just going to be kind of smoking out the corner of my eye and a little bit into the crease with that. I'm going to go in with a little bit of this white shade, which is called Your Majesty, 
and I'm going to go ahead and place that on my brow bone a little bit. And then once I have my foundation on, I'm going to take the shade Vivid Mood, which was that light purple I put in the crease, and I'm going to just drag it underneath my eye. Alrighty, so I'm going to get my mascara, my eyeliner, and my lashes applied off camera, and then I will be back. Alright, so now we have our lashes on, our eyeliner on, and our mascara on. I am going to prime my face really quick using the Benefit Professional Primer. And then I'm trying out a new foundation today. It is the Becca Ultimate Coverage 24-Hour Foundation, and it is in the shade Linen. Um, I did get this online um, through BoxyCharm Rewards. Whoops. So I didn't actually pay for it, so it is a little light, but I think as I do my contour and highlight and blush that it'll kind of blend it out a little bit. So let's get our primer put on, and then I will be applying my foundation. Alrighty, so now I'm going to take a little bit of that Vivid Mood, which was the purple from the Bloodlust palette by Jeffree Star, and I'm going to smoke out my lower lash line. Next, I'm going to go in with the Smashbox Cali Contour Palette. And I'm going to be using this shade right here, and I'm just going to get my face contoured out. And then we are going to take the Ciate London Coconut Setting Powder, and I'm going to bake my face. Alright, so now that our face is baked and our contour has set, we're going to take this big fluffy brush and just blend that all out. Alright, so we're all blended. I'm going to be using the NARS blush in Orgasm today. And that is what it looks like, and we will just grab a blush brush. Get that applied. So we have our blush applied and I'm gonna go pick a highlighter. All right, so I was gonna go with a purple highlighter, but I decided on this pretty 
marshmallow color from the Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit in Sugar. So I'm just going to take my little highlighting brush that I have here, dip that in a little bit. As you can see, it gives a really nice golden, soft glow color. And I've been using these brushes, they're the Alomar brushes that I got in a previous BoxyCharm, and I do really, really like them. I think they work very well. Can't forget the nose. Boop. And the Cupid's bow. And I'm going to go pick a nude colored lip, and I'll be back. I thought about doing a matte lip, but I am going to just use this Morphe Gloss. It is in the shade Flower Crown, and it's kind of just a light pink pinkish nude color. I don't want my lips to be the focus of attention today. I want my eyes to be. Alright, we got that put on. I'm going to be using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dewy Set setting spray, so we'll spritz that on a little bit. Smells so good. I love my coconut scented products. But that's going to be it for this video. I hope that you guys like the final look. Please give this video a like, comment, let me know what you think, and a thumbs up. If you would like, turn your notifications on so I don't have to bug you. And look forward to the next video. Let me guys, let me know if you guys would like a daily video from me. Um, with this whole set, like quarantine and social distancing, if it would give you something to watch and something to do during the day, let me know. Thanks for watching guys. See you next time.